I really have some exciting news for you today. I want to share with you the top 15 second chance banks that use Zelle. So here are non-check systems bank accounts, and uh, it's kind of important to understand that you can use Zelle even if you have uh, you've had some issues with uh, the banking system in the past. So let's just get right into it. Welcome back, folks, to another edition of the Awesome Sweetie Kiwi Show. How are you today? I hope you are doing fantastic. I'm doing marvelous, if you are to ask me. If you are doing as great as I am, go grab a cup of coffee or tea or vodka and let's roll. <laughs> In today's conversation, I want to share with you the top 15 second chance banks that use Zelle. Number 15, we have GTE Financial. Our score, 7 over 10. Now, GTE Financial is actually a credit union, but you get the gist. So basically, with the GTE, you are basically, they have a, a go further checking accounts that allows you, even if you've had issues with the banking system in the past, to still qualify for the go further checking. Now, with this, you don't have access, you cannot issue a check, okay, and you don't have any overdraft fee. So this is kind of cool. You also have the go student checking accounts that you can actually use. This is a free checking accounts for 12 to 24 year old students and this also is free you but you don't have the ability to issue a check from this accounts okay but uh, this two accounts allow you to actually send money through Zelle not a problem and what we love is that DG is fun is a constantly evolving they're giving their members a lot of opportunities to actually send money not just through Zelle but other payment systems okay and uh, the cool thing here is is that you can also be a member of this credit union very easily this is a national federal credit union you don't have to have some biology some geography or some profession uh, affiliation to qualify so gte financial seven over ten number 14 we have us bank us bank with through us bank you are able to send money through zelle okay and our score 7.5 over 10. what we love is that once you enroll with uh, zelle and once you enroll you have the preferred account with the us bank us bank does have they do have accounts for folks who have had some issues with the banking history in the past but with this if you if us bank gives you an account you cannot draw a check you cannot issue a check from that account and so you don't have a no uh, risk of overdraft fees this is kind of cool and the only thing is that you got to be a member of you got to have a, a us bank account and you want to have your direct deposit into that account so that's the only requirements they want you to have but uh, once you have once you've met that this is very easy and us bank is a national bank so you don't have to live in a specific country in a specific in a specific uh, state or region in, in the country to qualify okay and what we love is that um, they do have a constellation of a b bank accounts that they can actually propose to you so you just just give them a call tell them about your situation and they'll give you the bank account that you need to qualify for for zelle payments and also qualify as uh, someone who has a little history with uh, the banking system. Number 14, US Bank, 7.5 over 10. Number 13, we have here, Truist. Our score, 8 over 10. So with Truist, you can actually send money through uh, through Zelle or send money from Zelle. It doesn't matter. But what we love is that they do have uh, what they call the Truist Bright Checking Accounts. Okay, so this is a checking account that allows you to to send money and even if you have uh, issues in the past with the banking system they will still approve you it's very it, it, it has um it has a very low maintenance fee so you probably pay like twenty dollars i mean twelve dollars rather ten to twelve dollars but uh yeah as long as you have not been let's say involved in a fraudulent activity with your banking system in the past and with the banking system in the past they will accept you and what we love is that uh, you have a uh, you have the ability to have an account you can issue transactions you can issue payments but please you don't have the capability to issue checks okay and so you don't have any overdraft fees okay that risk is taken off so choice our score eight over ten number 12 we have td bank our score eight over ten with td bank you are able to move money in minutes on your phone or online through zelle and we love the fact that TD Bank has recently integrated its its uh, app with, with uh, Zelle, and the cool thing is that things happen instantaneously. You know, well, when we tried the system, when we tried their their platform, it took about two minutes. So when sending money from uh, Zelle to TD Bank or vice versa, okay, 
And uh, there is one account that you can uh, you might be interested in with TD Bank. It's called the TD Convenience Checking, and this is uh, this checking account has less stringent requirements. So if you have had some runnings, quote unquote runnings with the banking system in the past, and you have uh, some kind of uh, check systems, um, I would say uh, record. Okay, you can still qualify for the TD Convenience Checking. And with this checking account, you do not have the ability to issue checks. So you don't have any ability to have uh, any overdraft, uh, any overdraft uh, fees here. And you can also qualify for the T TD Simple Checking, the TD Essential Banking Account, the Student Checking Accounts, and the TD 60 Plus Checking. So you have a constellation of products with TD Bank that are, are very um, focused on folks who, have, uh, who are looking for a second chance bank. And the fact is that the good thing is that TD Bank is uh, quasi-national. I mean, they are strong on the Northeast. However, you don't live, you don't need to live in the Northeast. Even if you live in California or you live in uh, in Nevada or New Mexico, you could still qualify for a second chance bank banking account with TD Bank. Number eleven, folks, we have Santander. I would score eight point five over ten. So Santander has a good integration with Zelle and you're able to move money, for, you send money to friends, family and others you trust, okay? Right from the Santander Bank Mobile Banking uh, app. What we love with Santander is that they're constantly evolving also. And here the checking account that you want to be interested in is called the Santander Basic. Santander Basic Checking, okay? With this account, you have no ability to actually um, to issue checks. This is a second chance bank that allows you to rebuild your banking history to improve your banking history this is kind of cool and you have the ability to uh, send money instantly now the the, the only thing is that you have a, a few fees here you have three dollars for paper statements and you have a, there's no fee for paperless statements they do have a, a monthly fee of uh, three dollars also and they have an ATM withdrawal fee of three dollars for domestic non Santander ATM withdrawal so this is the real the only thing that we believe it's a little uh, it's it's not a deal breaker though don't get me wrong it's not a deal breaker but it's something to be aware of and the account deposit there's a minimum amount of twenty five dollars number ten folks we have regions bank our score 8.5 over 10 folks i'm still talking to you about the, the top 15 second chance banks that allow you that actually work with zelle okay and uh, regions bank has a great integration with zelle you can quickly and easily send money to people you know and uh, the cool thing here is that regions bank has a few checking accounts that they can customize for you to make sure that you are able to bank again you're able to have to have another foot in the banking door but you do not have the ability to write checks okay you do not have the ability to incur any overdraft fees and uh, so basically what we love with uh, regions bank is that they are constantly evolving so a few years ago they didn't have this uh, integration nowadays it's fully functional and uh, tens of thousands of uh, regions banks customers are pretty happy about it and so if you happen if you happen to have a record with check systems or or early warning systems or telecheck and you want you're looking for a second chance national bank now regions bank is not a national bank you know they're not with the same they're not a the same way uh, chase operates or wells fargo but however they they do have a strong regional footprint so if you're interested in the product check them out regions bank 8.5 over 10. Number number nine, folks. We have PNC Bank. Our score 8.5 over 10. PNC has a a strong integration with Zelle. Okay, so with just an email address, US mobile phone number, or Zelle QR code, you can quickly send and receive money with people you know and trust. And what we love with is that with PNC Bank, you do have a, a few choices. You have a few ways to, to get things done. They do have a PNC personal checking accounts that you can have. PNC is one of the few second chance banks that operate nationally okay obviously you might have a, a few you might have you do not have a full complete let's say a fully functional checking accounts with pnc bank if you're looking for second chance banking for example you you don't have the ability to issue checks 
okay but you are still in you're still in the door you get a foot you get your foot in the door and you start rebuilding or building your credit your uh, banking history not, a, not your credit history and we love that uh the yeah, pnc has been with zelle for a while now and uh, the integration works fantastically number eight folks we have a uh, fifth third bank our score nine over ten so fifth third is, uh, is another great player that allows you to have second chance banking while sending money through zelle and the cool thing here is that uh, you, you have um, their system, their mobile app is really great. They have uh, checking accounts for folks like you. If you happen to be in that category, somebody who's looking for a second chance banking and want to sell money through Zelle or receive money through Zelle. Okay. And what I want to say here is that you can manage your accounts with Fifth Third Bank easily. You can have control over your cards if you happen to have cards with uh, Fifth Third Bank. Okay. And one thing I also want to say when it comes to fifth third bank is that they may not have the national footprint of a chase a bank of america a wells fargo but they are strong regionally and uh, to actually they don't require you to live in a specific state before opening a second chance banking account no they will look at your profile as long as you're um, what you have been accused for or i mean what you have what you have in your record with check systems early warning system or um, telecheck there's nothing fraudulent about it there's nothing scamming about it they will accept you okay so it depends on the severity of your record number seven folks we have here discover bank our score nine over ten so discover bank is a great second chance bank that allows you to actually uh, send money from discover fast with zelle okay and you can send money uh, directly from your account to theirs typically in minutes and you can send or receive money right from the discover bank app and discover has also a few checking accounts that they can customize to uh, to give you a second chance banking operation if you will and we'll love the fact that discover is really well known when it comes to uh their uh innovative approach okay Ch their checking accounts is great okay you can get cash back on debit card purchases and no monthly fees okay and you have a one percent cash back on up to three thousand dollars in debit card purchases each month this is really great because you are able to the only thing is you cannot issue a check from that discover that discover um account and you don't have to worry about uh, insufficient funds okay so something you need to think about and we love the fact that discover will help you also not only build your banking history but also your credit history so this is just fantastic number eight number six folks we have citizens bank our score nine over ten and uh, so citizens and zell bring you a fast and safe way to move money and this is kind of cool because we love the fact that citizens has uh, a few checking accounts that are great for folks who are looking for a second chance banking and uh, and citizens bank is pretty good also in terms of uh in terms of helping you not only build credit history but also your banking history okay one thing you need to be aware of is that you have uh, you don't have to live in an in a state where citizens bank is present you can apply for their online account they will ask you for a few things they will check your uh, check systems record though but they will give you a second chance they will see as long as you haven't been accused of anything grossly fraudulent nothing very very scary you know if it's only nsf fees here and there overdraft fees here and there that's okay but if you've been involved in in some kind of scamming or whatever defrauding the banking system they will not approve you okay so citizens bank nine over ten giving uh, a second chance the banking operation to thousands of the, thousands of um, applicants in the country Number five, folks, we have Capital One. Our score, 9.5 over 10. So with Capital One, you're able to send money to friends and family with Zelle, okay? And they do have a very interesting uh, checking accounts, and that's called the 360 checking accounts. And this is a second chance checking accounts that allows you to actually do a lot of things. You can send and receive money in minutes between enrolled family and friends. You only use your U.S. mobile number or email address, never your account info. And their integration with Zelle is, is, is great because it's a fee-free way to send money from your Capital One mobile app. So there's no fees. There's no fee involved. Okay. So basically, if you are new to Capital One banking and you're looking for a second chance bank that has reputable, that has a great reputation in the country, 
checking out the 360 checking accounts from capital one and there are no minimums there are no fees there are no worries okay obviously you cannot issue a check from this account however capital one capital one has the national presence that you might need number four folks we have bmo harris bank our score 9.5 over 10 and with bmo harris you want to uh there is a great integration also they have great integration with zelle they have a fast safe and easy way to send money to people you know and trust and you only need to use bmo digital banking either online or through the mobile app okay and uh, what we love is that bmo is is constantly upgrading their collaboration with zelle they have uh, something called a zelle mobilize in other words you can mobilize your money with zelle mobilize and uh the the what we love is that you can send money you can actually request uh, money or you can split in other words you can easily divide the check for dinner coffee or more so this is really good and one thing i want to say is that with bimo harris they do have also three accounts up to three accounts that they can customize for you to give you a second a second chance uh, banking account and the, the only thing is again you don't have the ability to issue checks you don't have the ability to worry about nsf fees but again at the end of the day this is this is really good because that's what you want you want to have a foot back in the door of banking you want to have to want to rebuild your banking history and you want to get your records off of uh, uh early warning systems telecheck or uh, check systems i'll be right back right after this don't go anywhere Welcome back, folks, to another session of the Awesome Sweaty Kid. We show we are still having a conversation today about uh, the top 15 second chance banks that use Zelle. And uh, we have here number three, we have BECU, our score 9.5 over 10. BECU is actually a credit union. So this is Boeing Employees Credit Union, but they also have a great integration with Zelle. So you can actually uh, send money to friends, family, and other people you know and trust. Okay, all it takes is an email address or US mobile phone number. And with a few taps, you can send money to almost anyone with a bank account in the United States. And we love the fact that they, so what we love with uh, Zelle and BCU is the fact that BCU has made it very simple for their members to actually qualify. So being a, a credit union, you need to qualify for membership. You, you got to be a member to use it, but it, it's very fine. They do have accounts that will, they can, they can customize for you. Even if you have had issues with the banking history in with the banking system in the past, okay. Number three, BCU nine point five over ten. Number two, we have a lie bank, and our score ten over ten. And uh, so, really, what we love with a lie bank is that you have the ultimate bank that is online that allows you to actually do everything online. So you can so from your desktop, you can log into online banking, go to payments, and select send money with Zelle, okay. And uh, from your mobile device, you can open the Ally Bank mobile app and send select money with Zelle from the main menu. So once you are enrolled, you can start to send and, and receive money with almost anyone who has a bank account in the United States using their email address or mobile phone number. Okay, so this is kind of cool. And uh, we love the fact that Ally Bank is constantly expanding the products. They're constantly innovating. They're constantly improving their integration with Zelle. Number one, the best of the best in our view, Navy Fed. Our score 10 over 10. Navy Fed, of course, is a credit union, but again, they are basic. They are they give you a second chance a bank account, and you can send money fast with Zelle. Okay, and the cool thing here is that Navy Fed is constantly changing their uh, checking accounts offer to make sure that you even if to make sure that you are you have a chance of getting an account, even if you have you have had some history with uh, the banking system in the past. The only thing they don't want is they don't want someone who has been involved in fraud. If you have been involved with with fraudulent activities regarding the banking system, you might not qualify. Okay, the best way to do this is to give a call to Navy Fed and speak with someone and explain your situation. But yes, our score ten over ten. Let me give you a quick overview here, folks. So obviously, I've given you the top fifteen second chains banks that use zelle and uh let's have a quick conversation about zelle because everybody thinks they know what zelle does but they don't they really don't so zelle is a fast safe and easy way to send money 
directly between almost any bank account in the US, typically within minutes, okay? So with just an email address or a US mobile number, you can send money to people you know and trust. And the cool thing here is that uh, you can send money to friends, family, or and other people you know, okay? The, the only thing is you need to ask people to enroll with Zelle before you send them money. So this will help them get your payments faster. And um, so since money is sent directly from your bank account to another person's bank account within minutes, it's important to only send money to people you trust and always ensure that you have used the correct email address or US mobile number. So Zelle should not be used to send money to people you don't know or to purchase goods. This is not PayPal. PayPal is, is good for, some, for, for something else, okay? So you can send requests or receive money with Zelle all you have to do you have to log into your bank mobile app or digital banking uh, platform and from there you will see if your bank has an integration with uh, zelle you should be able to see it and you can send money to almost anyone who has a bank account in the u.s so the person must have a bank account if the person is not in the banking system zelle cannot be helpful to you okay and uh, so once you send the money what will happen is that you, the recipients will receive an email or a text message and if you, if, you send a mess, if you send money using their email address or US mobile phone number, so they'll get some kind of notification. So don't worry about that, okay? And the whole thing, the whole thing with Zelle is that you get money in minutes, okay? So basically, it's not, about, it's not about waiting for two days or three days. No, you get money in minutes. The problem is if you send money through Zelle with an email or phone, or phone number to someone who is not enrolled, they will receive a notification that prompts them to enroll. After they enroll, it may take up to three business days to receive the money you send, depending on processing times, okay? So once that payment completes, your recipient will typically receive future payments faster. So it's all about the initial is, uh, the initial problem is a little, uh, it's, 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 uh, it takes longer, okay? And if you happen to send money to, uh, if you send money to the wrong person, basically there are ways to actually send the money back, okay? So, but they always tell you to make sure that you're sending money to somebody trustworthy, okay? And uh, so this is really what it is. So overall, Zelle is a, great, is a great place to send money and receive money, a great platform, and yeah. So let me recap today's conversation. So I was talking to you about the, the top 15 second chance banks that use Zelle. Number one, Navy Fed, 10 over 10. Number two, Alia Bank, 10 over 10. Number three, BECU, 9.5 over 10. Number four, BMO Harris Bank, 9.5 over 10. Number five, Capital One, 9.5 over 10. Number six, we have Citizens Bank, 9 over 10. Number seven, we have Discover Bank, 9 over 10. Number eight, we have Fifth Third Bank, 9 over 10. Number nine, we have a PNC Bank, 8.5 over 10. Number 10, we have Regents Bank, 8.5 over 10. Number 11, Santander, 8.5 over 10. Number 12, we have TD Bank, 8 over 10. Number 13, we have Truist, 8 over 10. Number 14, US Bank, 7.5 over 10. Number 15, GTE Financial, 7 over 10. Thank you so much for your attention. I really appreciate it. I'll see you next time. But until then, remember, stay marvelous.